what is up guys it's risky here welcome back to some more call of the wild it's been a while since we've actually came out here and done some hunting but today we have a brand new weapon pack the modern rifle pack is finally out here today on all platforms yeah folks they finally released an update on all platforms on the same day big thumbs up to expansive worlds on that one man for not delaying it on consoles and stuff like they used to do that is awesome the first thing we're gonna be doing is testing out the a or excuse me not the ar <laughs> the zarza 15 or the ar 15 whatever you want to call it we're probably gonna just gonna call it the ar but i mean zarza honestly isn't that bad of a name zarza 15 that sounds pretty cool but yeah this is the zarza 15 22 and we're gonna be testing it out on this little turkey right here in front of us the one i'm most excited for is actually the 308 which is the Zarza 10. We're gonna get up pretty much to this tree and then we're gonna shoot this thing. He's actually bedded down right there, attentive a little bit, but not a big deal. I plan on comparing this thing to the uh, Virant, the 22 Virant in a future video. So stay tuned for that. But anyways, here we go. The first kill with the brand new AR, the Zarza 10. Should we try iron sights? Nah, I don't wanna miss this shot. We'll try them later though. I'll still miss, even with the scope. Dang, so this thing drops. I must be really far out of range. I must, I, I feel like it could shoot further than, th than that, <laughs> than without dropping, but okay. Uh, maybe I need to put the zeroing perk back on, but check out the reload animation there. Let's shoot that one more time. Slides the mag in. I wonder if we shoot the whole thing, does he pull the, uh, the shammer thing back? No, he doesn't like he would in real life. Kind of lame there, but oh well. It still sounds pretty cool, honestly. It kind of sounds like a paintball gun, but it's a 22 long rifle. It, it makes sense, I, I guess. I feel like it should have a little more of a pow to it. So it really wasn't the best shot uh, for our first test on the Zarza 15. But anyways, whoa, whoa, look at that emblem right there for golds. Interesting looking. That is definitely way newer. <laughs> Penetration. On the left hit, okay, yeah, just terrible shots overall, so we're not really going to be able to see the penetration. My bad there, the, that was, the shots were 135 out, and uh, I guess that's a little bit too far. Ooh, where we got up here running away? That looks like a pronghorn, and I do have the Zarza 10, which I'm pretty sure is what we're going to... Actually, you know what? We won't use the Zarza 10 on that. We're going to use the Zarza 15. Oh yeah, I like this one because it kind of looks like an M16. Really cool, really cool. Not exactly sure where our buddy old pal went over there he just had to have went up and over the hill i guess Ooh. okay well that's a, that's a that's a good uh sh thing to test the uh this gun on the zarza 10 308 right here Ooh. yeah i really like the sound of this one the 308 has the best sound of all of the ars in my personal opinion. I mean, honestly, I haven't shot the 223 in a while. But we're gonna save that one for a pronghorn. I just, I have no clue where the dang things went, man. They just disappeared on me. But yeah, that 308 right there just smacked that mule deer pretty good. Gave me a high bleed rate right into the lungs there. I can't get over that gold logo. That looks kind of, I feel like that's not gold. Like, I feel like the, the color of this, sh it should be gold. It looks kind of bronze. Maybe the bronze. I don't know. I haven't seen the other ones yet. I've only shot gold so far. <laughs> Anyways, it looks cool, though. It definitely looks... I don't know if I like it better than the old one or what, but I guess change is always good. Anyways, beautiful shot here. Quartering shot right through. I had enough penetration to go through that front shoulder and into both lungs, so that's that's really good. And a pretty nice mule deer, also. I uh, just had another one call right here. Uh-oh. Okay. I want to test out the iron sights. I'm just going to test it anyways. Oh, we freaking dropped that thing in two shots. I was not, I was not expecting that to be honest. That, that was cool. We just smoked that plains of bison. All right. And we got a herd of whatchamacallits here. That one sounds pretty good too. Where'd the others go? Oh, hey. Probably not the best shot there. Been a while since I've honestly gone out here and hunted. Been a while since I've been, I've used my mouse too, to be honest. I've been addicted to eye racing again. Shout out to anybody that plays eye racing. <laughs> Anyways, let's check out these amazing shots here. Okay, so the bronze, yeah, it looks like, it looks like bronze, I guess, a little, like, more like some pink gold, but okay. Maybe I'm colorblind. Oh, okay. So we spinal cord them, so that's probably why we dropped them. And that, okay, we spinal corded them twice. 
that'll explain why we dropped him so fast. But still, look at that penetration. Went through that front shoulder, up top, in halfway through the back and into the spine. I'm sure it would it would uh go into the lungs pretty good. Pretty unfortunate that we can't actually use this caliber to hunt these things because you can tell it would be perfectly fine against them. <laughs> it would do just fine. I don't know. I don't. I don't understand that, but. See your friends back there too. Yeah, just keep on running. I gotta admit, these ARs sound pretty good. The 223 one, or excuse me, not 223, the, the 22LR one, not so much, in my personal opinion. Sounds like a paintball gun. Not that there's anything wrong with paintball guns or anything, but you know, I just feel like 22 should sound more like 22. But the 308 and the 223 ARs sound really really good they're really satisfying to shoot i like it i like it man here's one we just destroyed her hit her way too many times first shot was a bad one so we kind of lost the check there but the two other shots were pretty decent penetration's not too bad it goes about halfway through we're there on the broad side at 58 meters out 59 actually let's try that again i want to actually get up on one that's standing broadside doesn't know i'm there and shoot it you know like we would if we're actually hunting you know what i mean duh we don't want to just like run up on them over the blue like we always do. Look, they're right here in front of us again. Oh, wrong gun. I keep pulling it out. Oh, that one's the one we wounded. Let's finish you off, old girl. Very nice. I love that it's semi-auto. You can just immediately go in for that follow-up shot. And, and miss it like that. I don't know where all the dang bucks are in this group. Didn't really seem like there was any. Ooh, we got a buck coming in right here. Might be able to smoke him. See if we can hit him all the way over here with the iron sights. Nope. Dang. Okay, well, we'll just screw off on him then. Or whatever. Not screw off on him, but just let him screw off. <laughs> uh, left lung there. These are just these little dang free money easy kill pronghorn that we're just running through i think if we do this we can we can like go like that oh, okay oh, okay he didn't like that very much i thought i see yeah i mean it used to be like where you could shoot right there and it would like make them stand up on their back legs you know and you could shoot them a little easier oh, okay it's okay he's turning back towards us we'll have another opportunity here once he gives us any shot at all I don't even care if it's quartering. I'm going to take it. You know, like that. Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, okay, yeah. He's already going down to 50, 75 on that. That's a good enough shot for me. Put one in her just for fun. Just because I absolutely love the sound of this thing. Jeez, it's just satisfying to shoot it. And the recoil is pretty satisfying too. Just the way it bounces up. It's, I, I don't know. Just one of those guns that are fun to shoot, which I like because to me, there's not a lot of unique guns in this game. A lot of them kind of feel relatively the same when you're shooting them, like at least the bolt action. So it's nice to have a, a unique, you know, AR semi-auto 308, which is it's, it's really cool. I'm really glad that they added this one. This is definitely my favorite one, I think. Wow, look at that nun icon. That's interesting looking. Yeah, you can just see the penetration of the 308 is so good, too. I'm going to shoot this guy again. Okay, I think I'm pretty sure we just spined them right there like we did the last one. <laughs> Man, that's satisfying when you shoot that thing and they just drop. So here is the black bear. Look at the penetration. Went through the side of him. Right through there, boom. And into his lung, stomach, and all those juicy parts in there. He's a dark fur type. Looks pretty cool. In the light, he kind of looks reddish brown. And here's the plains bison we smoked. Oh, it was a skull and brain shot. <laughs> okay, that was not the shot I was expecting to see right there, but still a very nice one. Uh, minus ruining the trophy organ, I guess. But who cares? We didn't even get the check, which is stupid. Bump up the 308 to level 9. Like, come on now, what's one more level? Okay, so the last gun I want to test is going to be the Zars 15. We got this little buddy right here in front of us. To test it on.
And I was kind of testing that sight at the same time. And yeah, it's just, you could, you could just tell how hard it was to aim from that far away with it. I mean, the, the dot is way too big. The sight is so, too far zoomed in still. So I'm kind of bummed. I was really hoping that the red dot was going to be like set up better because they said they're updating it. So I thought it was going to be super useful on these ARs. Really don't even think I made a good shot on that fellow. I might have to go find us another pronghorn to test this 223 on. I mean, I know we've already tested it, but I want to like just test it again <laughs> because we've certainly not tested it enough for sure. Got lots of ideas to do with these things. Hey there, bud. I think we put him out of his misery there. <laughs> Let's check out the penetration. Well, the first shot was a neck shot. We missed the neck bone, so we ruined it. Flesh right in his back leg there, and then this one went in and actually hit him in the heart, so... <laughs> Pretty good shot placement there, damn. Anyways, that's gonna do it for this one. The new weapon pack, I definitely recommend buying it. The Zarza 10 is just worth the $4 in general. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this little first look. Be on the lookout for more content that has to do with these new guns. We're going to be doing some more hunts with them, some just fun things with the mods eventually. So, yeah, don't worry. We got some awesome content on the way. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.